If content creation puts food on your table, if you just make content for someone else or you own an agency and you just want to make viral content all the time without much effort and do everything in your own style and voice, then this tool is for you. Pressmaster.ai, the link is going to be down there in the description and now I'll show you the power of it because it's not your regular AI assistant when it comes to content creation. First of all, Pressmaster can do it in your own voice, right? You set it up once and then it's going to be on autopilot. Hooks, different posts for different social media profiles because, you know, it's not the same on Twitter and on Instagram. Different things are going to work on both of these and on Facebook and on LinkedIn. So basically, they just thought of everything and it's all in one place. So let's just go from the start. First of all, here on the web page, after you click on the link, click on the get started button. It's free, of course, for the first seven days. I'm going to talk about that later on, but I'll just show you the inside of it now with my account. This is going to be your dashboard. Now, whenever you make yourself a new account, the first thing you should do is to head over to the settings tab here, which is located right here. Click on it. And from here, you can develop your brand guide. Brand guide is really important that you do because this way you will train the AI to understand your business or to understand your intentions. There's going to be an interview. You're going to answer some questions. Also, you can always edit and, you know, revisit your responses anytime. In here, you can establish your brand voice by providing content samples, right? So you can put articles, you can put voice interviews. And when it learns all of that, it'll behave just like you. And this is what you need if you want, for example, a constant newsletter or a constant blog or, you know, if you just want to run some company's LinkedIn profile in a consistent manner. Well, this is for you. And after you're done with this, well, you can head over to the my articles section here. First of all, they've got many integrations here. You can see you can integrate this with your Facebook profile, LinkedIn, Instagram, X or Twitter, Blue Sky, a lot of WordPress sites, Blogger, because this is going to allow you to publish directly from this dashboard. You don't have to go over and switch tabs. That's pretty good. But let's just go to the articles section right here where you can just go and, you know, just write a new article. I'll show you the breeze of it and some really cool features now. First of all, click on this button here, which is called new article, of course, and then you just write the topic of it. Let me just increase the size for this. So this is your basic prompt. Of course, you can add files or images here to act as a reference, or you can choose from library. Now, the library is your own library where you can just take pens, you can take posts, and you can take articles and interviews that you made earlier. Right. So whatever you make, it's going to be in your library. So later on, you can reference to that same thing because, for example, you've liked it or it performed well in the past. So here now you tell them what is the article about with these references if you've got them. So let's just go with something like this. I'll just go with something generic as AI, something that everyone should use in 2025. I'll just click on this button here. And first of all, it is just going to give you the setup for it. You're going to have some of these videos that you can watch whatever you make yourself an account. I'm just going to skip them now. So content type here, as you can see, whether you want to make press release, thought leadership or company news, then there's going to be content focus. What do you want to focus on with this article? For example, if you're making something for someone like a create a how to tutorial, this is what you're going to see and use down there. There's some report research findings data. You know, this is just for your use case. Maybe you just want to make a gig out of this, which is not a bad idea at all because people are making huge deals of money just by drop servicing these kind of things. I'll show you that later on. Here you choose the length, the theme and the tone, the brand voice here, of course, you're going to choose your own here, then web citations and search. This is going to give you some reference and some credibility to your articles. And then this is the most interesting part. What is the type of this interview and what is the type that you're going to use for this particular article? Well, the quick one, well, it's just like, you know, 
generated article just like for example chat gpt would give you adaptive here on the other hand you can chat with ai in real time and you can guide it but this is my favorite one and it's conversational you know you can talk to the ai and you know let it know about your thoughts and then it'll use it in order to make this article let me just show you how this works so first of all it's going to develop this strategy of yours it's going to go with the angle and you can always change this you can you know type here to change the strategy whatever you don't like you can change it here but if you do like it click on approve and continue and then this is going to open up this is the conversation so let me just show you allow the microphone of course here click on okay hello thank you for joining me today I'm excited to interview you about the future of artificial intelligence and its potential universal adoption by 2025. To start our conversation, I'd like to ask, what key technological advancements do you believe will occur in the next year or two? So as you can see, it'll ask you questions directly as if it's an interview, all right? And it's a really cool feature, you know, you get to talk to it or, you know, someone else gets to talk to it, someone in your company, whatever, whoever, you know, knows and has more info on the given topic. And then this will also give you a score because if you see down there, there's going to be content uniqueness. And when you start to share with it, it's going to give you a score and it's really good. It's really neat. And also it saves a lot of time. So yeah, I just like it. Now, when the article is done, you're going to see it here on the right hand side and on the left hand side here, you can use this chat to improve the article in the way you think it can be improved. So chat with AI, for example, you can just go with you now just check it out. And for example, you can just go and copy this section here. You can paste it here and then just improve this part and the AI is going to do the job. It's really easy and it's really intuitive. Anyone can use the tool. It's a breeze, honestly. And, you know, it's just going to get the work done. It'll show you the changes. You can reject the changes if you don't like them. But if you like them, click on accept all and, you know, article content is updated. So you can work with SEO here. You've got generic settings here. You can change these all the time. You've got comments here if you work with somebody else. And of course, you can always change it as a draft or you can right away, if you click on it, you can publish the article with this button here. But I'll just save it as a draft now because I've got something else to show you. And this is the most powerful feature, Social Suite, which is gonna, well, it's just gonna blow your mind. Click on new post, click on AI post here, and then you select the channels. For example, I want to post for Twitter and I want to post for LinkedIn. All right. Here you type the description for post or you choose content from the library. So for example, I liked that article that we've just made. I can just click here, choose from rivalries, click on articles here, and then choose the article that we've just made. Right off the bat, Pressmaster is going to make me posts suited for these social media profiles, social media networks. All right, click on the continue button and then you're going to see it. Similar setup is here. You choose the options here that are available. Click on the approve and continue and then it's going to engineer the hook. It's going to test against thousands of simulated minds. They're shaped by real behavior to understand what's going to be the best hook for you to use for that particular content. And it's going to give you the score. It's really, really good. So as you can see, my hooks have been tested. This is, of course, going to be the best one. You see the 90 score. Click on approve and create post. And of course, you're going to get two different ones for LinkedIn and for X because, well, they behave differently. And what works on one can't work on the other one. And here you can see it. One is for LinkedIn. This is how it's going to look like. The other one is for X, acts out like a thread. So it's really, really good. You can, of course, always chat with AI in order to change Twitter and LinkedIn and all the other one separately. 
and you know whenever you're ready you click on the publish now it's going to go over to these platforms if you've you know made the integration I'll just save this as a draft because I want to show you something else, which is Trend Master here. You have to set this up whenever you make yourself an account. You set the preferences here. And this is going to analyze the trend within your industry and it's going to give you a lot of info and a lot of ideas so you can choose for your topics. This is really good and a lifesaver also. You know, it just saves a lot of time. You don't have to research anymore, you know? It's just going to do it all for you. So, for example, if I choose advertising and marketing, if I choose entertainment media here and then click on continue, then I choose a region worldwide. Let's say I want to use English in this case, but there's many more. As you can see, you can get it on your email as well. As you can see, you apply these preferences and this could take some time. But after this, it's just going to give you all the news all the new things that came out within that selected industry and then you can just click on them and make the article from them or posts or whatever it's really good it works similar to the pins section here which allows you to for example paste any kind of link or you can post you can just upload a pdf file or let's just take this youtube video for example i take this youtube video it's a ted talk and then i just paste it here and I click on this button here. Firstly, it's going to analyze the content. It's going to, you know, just generate the summary of it. And now when it just gives you the summary of the whole video, so it understood the video, you click on create here and then you can choose new article or a new social media post. All right. So it's a really good thing. If you like something online and you think it can work for your business or for your clients, whatever, you just take it. You just save it inside of these pins. You can use the mobile app to save your pins. It's a really good option. By the way, there is an app on the App Store and on Google Play as well. So you can have it on the go as well. So whether you want to use it for yourself or you want to drop service Pressmaster, which is also a really good option. I see a lot of people making some cool money just by writing SEO blogs or creating like 30 unique social media posts for, you know, 70 bucks. It's a really good option. And if you take into consideration that Pressmaster is only $12 per month if you just want to start with it or $72 per month if you take the annual discount, well, it's a really good option. There is seven days for free, so you can just test it out, see it whether it's for you or not. If you want to take the monthly version, these are going to be the prices. So yeah, the link is going to be down there. Wish you good luck, use it well, and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.